From their humble beginnings as a small meat market, Perry's has stayed true to their roots, serving only the finest cuts of hand-selected USDA-aged meat. And here, their pork chops are really, really good. Corporate chef for Perry's Steakhouse and Grill. We're talking to, this is Grant Hunter. You're joining me this morning. Thank how you for having you? us. I was a little distracted by how uh, good it smells. I almost forgot oh, well, the first name. So obviously the, the recipe here is secret, so we yes. won't disclose that, but here it's seven fingers high. It's a seven finger high pork chop. That's how, pork chop. That's how they kind of, the old butchers measured things back in the day was by seven fingers high. Seven fingers, okay. So we still do the seven finger high measurement. It's a uh, slow smoked, roasted, and caramelized it, for about 46 right hours. That's what we're looking at. It's a pretty large cut. That's it's anywhere from 32 cut. to 34, six ounces. It's topped with a little bit of steak butter and then finished with a lime. Well, it's absolutely fantastic. So when we come to Paris, this is how it's going to be presented to us, but... It's brought to the table okay. this way, presented, and then we actually carve it table side, so and it's broken it? down right into three pieces. Uh, this is called the eyelash. And then you have the loin and then you actually have the ribs and the ribs are separated so we like you to enjoy it with your hands at the table so <laughs> oh, you it's like actually to get pretty really fun messy. yes ma'am and dig in yes okay ma well you have to give us i know it's a secret recipe but maybe give us some tips on how maybe we can pre prepare a pork chop sure at if you want to do it at home the easiest way to do it similar to this any kind of barbecue spice you would like okay a little bit of barbecue spice a little bit of black pepper smoke it over hickory oak pecan a size pork chop like this takes about six to eight hours, normally about 225 degrees on a smoker. Okay, very so. nice. Now, are you going to cut this one up for us? We're going to leave it alone because it's We're really pretty. We're going to leave it alone because it's real okay. pretty. Okay, but we are going to make something on uh, one of your sides. It's the yes. green corn. So tell it's me about it's one of our signature sides. Why it's, why it's a signature? Because it's a summer dish and we're doing stuff for dad right now, so we okay. thought we'd bring out our roasted cream corn. Okay. During the summertime, the hot work. months, the corn gets a little bit sweeter. So with the roast, you can start it off. It's an easy dish to do at home. We're gonna start off with a little bit of yellow onion. Oh, you hear that? Gonna, that means I have to step away. <laughs> we're gonna start off with a little bit of jalapeno, just for a little bit of spice. Now, but if with there's the anything I can do, I'll do it for you. Like stir. Sure. I'm if you want, stir if it. you want to put the bell peppers in. All of them? Uh, half of them. Okay, there we go. And I'll let you give it a it's quick nice, stir. Nice and colorful here. And with the jalapenos, if you take the seeds out and the veins, it doesn't make it quite as spicy. Okay. We're gonna add a little bit of garlic. I see. How am I doing, Chef? You're doing fantastic. Yeah? Have a backup plan, maybe in Paris? Somewhere? Yes, <laughs> I have an opening. Oh, good. Then we're going to add in the lovely the roasted corn. corn. And the corn, so, you can do it two different ways. You ooh. can put it in the oven and roast it, or you can actually put it on the grill outside and roast it. Okay. The grill outside will give it a little bit more flavor. Man, I wish you guys could smell this. The corn alone wasn't like so rich. Now, what we is had, this? We had two sauces okay. to our cream corn. This is Alfredo sauce. And then we add a vegetable. It See, now floor, you just lost so. your job. <laughs> really? <laughs> I thought that meant so I was putting like passion behind it, so, no, okay. We do two different sauces. We do an Alfredo sauce, which is a white wine cream sauce, and then we do a bechamel sauce, which is a cream-based sauce with a little bit of onions, a little bit of nutmeg. We're okay. just going to add just a pinch okay. of salt. Very good. A pinch of pepper. All right. And then we're going to add in a little herb mix. The herb mix you can do any Ooh. way you want to at home. Ooh. This is a mixture of rosemary, thyme, a little bit of parsley, and a little bit of... Uh, chives. That smells very nice. One Good. minute, bring it to a simmer like it is. Okay. It's ready to go. And that's it. And that's well, we fantastic. Have, we have right over here. That's and we have, the, we have it right here in the See. front that's plated and ready to go. We also have a couple other side dishes that we brought. We brought our sriracha glazed Brussels sprouts. I'm going to go for the one that's not steamy hot, right? Yeah, this one's a little cool. Mm. The Brussels sprouts are lightly flash fried with a little sriracha caramel sauce. A little it is sweet. an appropriate summer side. It is. Very it's good. a little sweet. Mm. You get the sweet from the corn, but you get a little bit of heat from the peppers, but not too much because we've taken the veins and the seeds out. That is delicious. So. This is good. Okay, obviously we want you to, to come in and try it for yourself, but especially you're uh, keeping the dads in mind for Father's Day on June Keeping 18th. the dads what, in mind, celebrating dads, June 18th. We're doing a special from 4 to 9 for uh, $29.95. You can come in, choice of six salads, of course the famous pork chop, and then the dessert trio, which has our vanilla cream brulee, our praline cheesecake, and then our chocolate crunch for dessert, so you get a little trio of all three. Chuck, so it's fantastic. This is, this is hey, if you if you need some ideas for Father's Day, here it is right here. Come in alone for the cream corn, but the seven finger high pork chop. Thank you for coming in and Thank sharing you for this having with us. Yeah, you bet.